Hello everybody. Today we're going to be talking about simplifying some expressions and looking for equivalency given um, a choice of expressions. Let's warm up here with just a combining like terms. Uh, notice the 0.2n and plus 2n plus 4. Our like terms are the 0.2n and the 2n. We can add those together to give us 2.2n. And notice there's really nothing to go with the 4. So our simplified answer here is 2.2n plus 4. Now we're going to be looking at some equivalencies. And we have it by the way of multiple choice. Question says, which expression is equivalent to 13x minus 29x? A couple ways to look at this. We could take this expression and simplify it and 13x minus 29x is going to give us a negative 16x. So what we could do is simplify each of these choices and then go down until we see a match for negative 16x, but you might see it before then. All right, let's start with D and just work our way up and see if we can get lucky. All right, so we're going to distribute 13 to the x and 13 to the 29. Well, that gives us 13x plus 377. Can't simplify that down, and that certainly does not match our negative 16x. So it d's out. And then looks like we get a very similar thing here if we distribute the 13 and get 13x minus 377. Can't combine those terms. C's out. On B, we could distribute the x and we get 29x minus 13x. That looks similar to the original problem up here, but the numbers are reversed. In fact, if we simplify this down, we'll get a 16x. Now, we were looking for a negative 16x. Hopefully, A works. Distribute the x, 13x minus 29x. And yeah, notice that matches perfectly the original problem. If we simplify it down, it does equal this negative 16x. Let's go to one more here. Which expression is equivalent to 10q plus 5? All right, 10q plus 5, nothing here simplifies. It's just 10q plus 5. So we're looking for that in one of these. D's out. 5q plus 5 is not the same. C's out. 5q plus 10, the 5 and the 10 are reversed. It's not the same. Let's simplify B and see what we get. 10q plus 10. Close, but not quite. So hopefully it's A. 5q and 5q make 10q and then we have the 5 left over. So A is our winner here. 10Q plus 5 matches. All right, hope you uh, learned a couple things about equivalent expressions. Hopefully these examples make sense. Thank you for watching.